With a triple whammy of COVID-19 inflation and interest rate hikes mostly behind us, there is a notable improvement in the balance sheets of Malaysian public listed companies, judging by the debt and cash positions. We spoke to analysts to understand the reason behind such trends and to economists on how to make sense of the data. Our cover story also looks into companies with perpetual bonds to see how they affect issuers' gearing and profitability. And Setian country Marseille Group plans to bulk up its property investments portfolio with industrial assets for more recurring income and expand its plastic manufacturing business into other ASEAN countries. Founder and Group Managing Director Tan Sri Leong Hoi Kam also intends to list its plastic and rubber glove manufacturing segments soon. In options, the spotlight is on former New Zealand All Blacks star Dan Carter, one of rugby's greatest living legends. He talks to us about phase two of life, his strong growth mindset and how pressure is often the pathway to greatness. In Digital Edge, Digital Penang is building an ecosystem to accelerate the state's digital transformation. At the core of the plan is a concerted effort to boost digital literacy, catalyze innovation and automation, and enhance transparency and efficiency in public service delivery through more data-driven practices. Details in this week's edition of The Edge. Save by subscribing to us for your print and or digital copy. The Edge is also available on Apple's App Store and Android's Google Play. Thank you.